All right. Uh, I think today is like the 9th, Tuesday the 9th, June or somewhere. Let's take a little look. I just ate a couple of cucumbers out of the garden today, a couple of picking cukes. They were good. Oh, what else did I get done today? Oh, I built a, well, I built a bird bath. I got the cucumbers all tied up, which helped out. They're all straightened out. I trimmed them a little bit. So now I'll be able to see. There was one big one hiding in there I ate. Uh, we got the squash plants. They're doing real good. The watermelons are starting. It's been warm. They'll start to take off. This lettuce is getting picked this weekend, whether I want to or not. I want that bucket for melons. We've got the little pepper plant there. We've got a tomato plant that the neighbor took, couldn't do. We've got some squash in the bucket. I'm going to try. We've got a vine growing up here. Pretty little thing. We got some watermelons we're trying in a bucket. And we got some cukes over here. Oh, these cukes are doing all right over here. The first ones died. We got that rain. And they just died. They couldn't handle it. But everything seems to be looking pretty good. I pulled the squash plant. I had one winter squash in there mixed in with all the summer squash. So that one's going to grow up and over to the fence. I don't care what it thinks. The basil's going to get moved. So give me that bucket. We got some beets down in there that are starting to take off. We got some Brussels sprouts with a winter squash stuffed in there too that'll grow out through the garden. We got some onions and some carrots mixed in together over there. Our eggplant gonna get sprayed tomorrow. The temperature's gonna drop enough to, so we don't fry the plants. We're gonna spray all the squash with some neem oil, get rid of some of the bugs and the disease. Got a few flowers coming along. Just put the honeysuckle vine in today. And me and Braden put together a little arch for it to grow up over here. So we got the honeysuckle vine on one side that's gonna grow and we got that other flowering vine over there that's gonna connect to it. I transplanted a bunch of um, squash plants in here yesterday from cups. So I think, they'll, I think they're gonna make it. It was hot, but they're gonna make it. Everything's looking pretty good in, in the garden. We'll swing around here. We got our potatoes in the hay, and some of those are starting to pop out down low. I had my doubts, but they are. Uh, oh, we built a little bird bath here. With some water. And we've got the tomato cage over there that's starting to get pretty big. Everything should clean up in about another week. We should be doing all right. And then we've got a couple of tomato plants left here, and some one gallon buckets, and a couple of pepper plants. Uh, I got a few other plants, but I got some flowers that I started over here. I think those are hollyhocks down in there. I forgot what those are, but those flowers are coming along. And I got some transplanted other flowers over there, so we're going to get some color in here before the end of the summer. Blueberries got moved. Those are looking pretty good. The bushes are starting to take off, so God willing, we'll have blueberries next year. We got, we got a few extra plants we haven't put in yet. I got some peppers and some tomatoes. I got some paste tomatoes and some romas down here I want to put in. It's getting dark, so let's take a quick peek. There's a couple more tomatoes that I never got in the ground. These tomatoes, they're looking good. I got to get out here and stuff them back in the cages. Some of them grew about. I just stuffed these in the other day. And Christ, this one here, it's grown a couple of inches. We've got tomatoes everywhere around here. I don't know if I've got too much water on them or what, but they're getting leaf curl on me, and I don't like it. I think that's from over water, but it's been so damn hot. Yeah, I got bad leaf curl going on on some of them. I'm going to have to let them, huh? Yeah, even on these, I think we're getting over, I think I'm over watering. Yeah, the damn, I got to let them dry out some. I don't like that leaf curl. It wasn't nearly as bad, but I watered everything the other night. Either that or it's too dry, I don't know. I'm gonna let everything dry out for about a, four days to see what happens. I sprayed some neem oil on these plants the other day on some of the leaves and they're doing all right. So we're gonna spray everything. Uh, that lettuce is starting to bolt. It means that'll be coming out. Flowers are starting to bloom over here. I gotta pick pea pods in the morning. I forgot to do it today. And we've got some spices over here to put in the ground still. I want to thank Linda for dropping me off the bags of grass for the mulch. 
And I've got some purple basil down there that's got to get put in. Got a couple of bags of pro mix because I'm going to start some seed for the midsummer planting. I want to plant some secondary crops. You guys all have a good night, and we'll try to get you a video out tomorrow. I'll show you what the, pro what the progress is. See you later.